Planet Dolan. From judicial crows to the reason your cat is a zoological Rubik's Cube, we look at eight things animals do that we can't explain. Hey everyone, my name is Melissa. I'm here to caress your brain cells with weird facts from all over the world. Number eight. A lot of people know that crows can hold grudges. There's some even more bizarre behavior involved. Research shows that crows captured and released for study would squawk at their captors years after the event. But not only that, the next generation would also do the same thing. Now, the smart conclusion would be that young crows were just following the older crows. Makes sense, right? Except that further studies showed that nests would still react the same way without an adult crow raising them. Meaning that these fledgings somehow know this one particular human is in danger without being taught it. Number seven. A bird's ability to migrate back to the exact same places every change of season has baffled scientists for years. You've probably heard of birds flying south for the winter, but what that doesn't tell you is that they fly back to the exact same places every year. One study captured cuckoos and released them over a thousand kilometers away from their home, but the birds were still able to get back to their normal migration route. There's still no solid explanation as to how the creatures manage it. While humans are more increasingly being forced to rely on GPS guidance, mainly because we're too dumb or lazy to read a map half the time, birds are upstaging you with a walnut-sized brain. Number six. Did you know that pretty much every creature with a spine yawns, and yet we still don't know exactly why? This mystery behavior that has long plagued your all-nighters is shared with most of the animals on Earth. Monkeys, lions, dogs, cats, hell, even fish do it. Not only that, but contagious yawning isn't just in humans either. It's even been observed happening in chimps. So what's the deal? Is every living thing just really bored? Well, we don't know. But there are several theories from it helping to regulate brain temperature to being the body telling it to stay alert and watch out for predators. Number five. Now, when you think animals that do weird shit, cows wouldn't be the first one to jump to your mind. But much like a librarian who's into Fifty Shades of Grey, cows hide a dark secret behind their mundane exterior. And that secret is that they all eat standing in the same direction. Now, hang on. The weirder part is that they only eat facing either north or south. We don't know why or even how the cows know they're facing in the right direction, but it happens all over the world. Maybe grass only tastes good when you're looking at the North Pole. Who knew cows were such food snobs? Number four. Okay, this one isn't technically an animal, but damn, is it unexplainable? And it might just make you believe in souls. Scientists doing some experiments exposed caterpillars to electric shocks when a certain smell was released. When the caterpillars turned into moths, they released the same smell and the insects fled, assumingly because they would be expecting a shock. No big deal, right? The bugs simply remembered. Except, when a caterpillar enters its cocoon stage, what happens is a long process of the caterpillar turning into liquid goop and then reforming as a moth. They are more or less two entirely different beings, but somehow the insect is able to transfer memories between bodies despite not having a brain. Number three. Mass animal suicides happen and are happening all the time. And we're kind of all just, meh, about it all, but it really is pretty disturbing. Mass whale beaching, cows and sheep jumping off cliffs and herds, birds flying into the ground. It's like some bad end of days movie. But these occurrences aren't as freak as you'd believe. There's even a bridge in Scotland that dogs have been throwing themselves off since the 1950s. So why do they do it? Well, each case has a variety of answers, but each one doesn't 100% cover the circumstances. Maybe we need to just pump a whole bunch of Xanax into the food chain. Number two. Yes, it's time to go back to talking about crows, because goddamn they are the weirdest acting birds in the world. Aside from holding grudges, crows also hold trials. Well, we assume they are like trials, or courts, but really, it seems to be more like a ritualistic murder. A large group of crows will gather in a circle on clear ground, squawking until the defendant crow arrives. That crow enters the circle and will squawk until the others decide they have had enough to peck him to death. Experts can't fully explain this behavior, stating that it isn't a territory issue because so many crows are present, and that it isn't a cannibalism thing because they don't feed on the body. You know what? I'm just gonna stay the hell away from crows from now on. Number one. Who would have thought that the fluffy ball of love and terror sitting on your lap would hold one of life's greatest mysteries? Why do cats purr? Simple question. 
very complicated non-conclusive answer. Most people assume that a purring cat is a happy cat, but really, purring is an emotional response to both I'm happy I'm being patted, to dear god I'm scared for my life. But cats also purr when they have neither of these emotions going on. Some even believe that cats purr to vibrate their muscle tissue to promote growth and healing. But considering we don't even know how cats are able to purr, working out the why is always going to be a lot harder. So guys, what's the weirdest thing you've ever seen an animal do? Let us know in the Reddit page linked below, and you may be featured in a future countdown. Thanks for watching! These cute mammals have the smallest brains of any mammals known to man, making up only 2% of its body weight. Their favorite food is eucalyptus leaves, which are so hard to digest that the animal had to develop four stomachs to deal with it.